What's up guys? So, uh, why is the daily driver, the SRT, why is my SRT4 the, the best uh, daily driver? I'm gonna show you guys, so here we go. So, gas, you can see it's, it's on E. It's on empty, right? Right, Bella? It's on empty, so we're about to fill up. Let's see how much it takes to fill it up. guys so as you guys were able to see uh, $30 filled it up right see what kind of mileage we get so I can show you guys why it's one of the best daily drivers We're doing a review on the 2005 uh, SRT4 Dodge Neon, right? It's a Neon. So anyway, um, what we're gonna do this quick. Diamond Planet floor mats, four door. They call these the, S uh, the Viper seats, I guess. It has a sunroof, nice little Alpine stereo, five speed. I mean, pretty, pretty basic. Power, power windows in the front. And if you guys don't know, um, it has a, it has manual windows in the back. Yep. Kind of unique situation, right? Yeah, it's like I got the camera stuff back here. Trying to make it kind of quick. What I do like about the SRT4 is you can pull the seats down like this. I did remove the baby chair uh, so I could show you that, guys this. Uh, but yeah, the, the, the seats fall down. Uh, also, to open the trunk, you push this button here. And there's your truck, pretty nice and roomy. Dual exhaust. Um, these are the stock wheels. It does have uh, springs on it, stock tail lights. <laughs> it has 112,000 miles almost, it looks like. We're gonna turn on the heater for my daughter. Uh, 112,000 miles. And front wheel drive. So it is front wheel drive. It has a, a 2.4 turbo. It has a strut bar. And then, uh, the engine intake, I think that was pretty much stock. It does have an HP waste kit. You can see it back there. For those of you guys that want to pull, do a pull. And then it has a aftermarket uh, motor mounts. That does help for uh, when you take off. It gets rid of the wheel hop. But that's pretty much it, just pretty basic. Front wheel drive. What I do dislike about it is the uh, turn in radius sucks. The shifting is not as smooth. It is five speed. Uh, so the transmission is not as smooth as it could be. Like I said, it has a boost gauge. So it has a boost gauge. It has a sunroof. The sunroof is just a push button. You push the button. Actually, sunroof works pretty good. No complaints there. Uh, it has three cup holders. Two and one. AC works great. It has a turbo timer. These cars push about... I think it's, they said it was like 240. But Dodge lied about it. It has about 250. Has a little bit more than what they said it had. A lot of pretty good top end. This car is equivalent to, um, you know, uh, a Cadillac CTSV as far as this one, the, the way it sits. And then it has a, um, it has a bigger front mount intercooler too. I just redid the headlights. Uh, but yeah, 2.4, 2.4 turbo. And a nice wing, big wing, 2005. You know, uh, 2005 they put a big wing on these cars. They did put nicer gauges where it says SRT4.
over here? What happened? <laughs> 911, what is your emergency? I hear shots! Okay, ma'am, calm down. What kind of shots? Hello. <laughs> On that saying that you didn't hear anything when we were sitting right there and, and heard cannons going off. I mean, there's no way you didn't hear them. The buddy got gone. Fucking liar! Did it go 30 times? Did it go back, you back, wanna, back, 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 Yeah, back, you wanna hear? Times? You wanna hear? I, yeah, I'll do it. Stop talking, crank it up, show me. Cause you know you ain't gonna do it. Okay, you you ready? I'm ready. This turkey? Yeah, it's this turkey. Hey, what's going on? What'd you do? I pushed the gas and a, a cop showed. That's not good. Why are you pushing the gas? You told me to. <laughs> I told her to step on the gas and she got on it and uh pretty much uh uh, a police officer showed up, and if you guys look behind me, uh, I think it's like a TMCC uh, police, right? We're gonna get out of here, but as you guys can see, um, the uh, the SRT force is pretty loud, uh, so loud that a cop showed up. I, I'm thinking they were, they're, he thought there was shots fired, maybe, right, Daya? What do you think, Daya? I kind of got scared because I'm the one who caused the police officer to come. Hey, I didn't step on the gas pedal. You told me to. Who stepped on the gas pedal? Yeah. So anyway, we're out of here. Um, short vlog, pretty funny. I thought it was hilarious. Let me know what you guys thought. <laughs> oh I thought it was pretty funny, actually. This guy thought there was people shitting over here. Probably how that. Yeah. So anyway, guys, uh, hope you guys enjoy uh, your work week. We did go in the morning, go get Pana the Panaderia. Hot clutch. Uh, these cars were probably like the third fastest car in 2005 that Dodge made. That Dodge made. Dodge made uh, at that time probably what was it the Dodge Viper the, and the Viper SRT10 and um, this is uh, pretty much what brought the SRT uh, back besides the Viper but anyway guys a uh, great daily driver I like it because it's four doors um, I can put my kids in the back and you know uh, they can kind of make a mess on this car right there and I don't really care as much yeah, yeah right as much as the uh, GTR right so it, ha it has a baby latch system in the back for the car seat, which is pretty cool. Um, airbags, heater works great, AC works great. My friend was the original owner, Eliza, shout out to you. Uh, he paid about 34K, 34,000 for this car. So I bought it off of him. Uh, he, he tried to baby it for a long time and then he just kind of left it parked for years. Things that have broken are the, uh, the timing belt, the clutch. Uh, one of the things that keeps going out on this car is the turn signal switch. I've replaced it three times, I think. Three times I think I've replaced it. So that, that's kind of a shitty design, I think. Um, besides that, the light went out, I think, when my friend first got it, Eliza, on the gauge for the turbo, for the boost. Much what do you like about this car? Then? Record yourself. What I like about this car is that I, I like how it goes fast, and but the thing I hate about it is that when my dad pushes the gas, it smells really bad. Why do you think it smells bad? Because probably used to. It smells bad because it's having problems with the exhaust. The catalytic converter fell off, mm. right? The catalytic converter fell off. We're gonna fix it, but that's why you can smell the exhaust fumes. So when I pushed the gas, it smelled like something was burning. You're out of control there. You're so out of control. My daughter's so out of control. Get putting, uh, stepping it on the gas that the cops showed up. You know on the map, right? Uh, you guys see Javi? Javi's pretty funny, and uh, we're gonna try to do some more cars. We haven't done vlogs because of the weather though. The weather's been pretty bad, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Sunny, it's so it's windy. You can't hear the. You, you won't be able to hear the the voices if uh, if I did record. So Tahoe's been having uh, record storms. Like and when I say record, they're they're we used to have storms like that when I was a kid. I grew up in North Shore Lake Tahoe and Tahoe Vista actually, my hometown, Kings Beach and Tahoe Vista. Shout out to KB as my friends would say. Um, and um, yeah. So anyway, uh, they've been having record storms. So when Tahoe gets a storm, what that means is we get very windy here in Reno. We got a little bit of rain or, or snow and we got a little bit of rain i mean a little bit of snow but it's been very windy so we haven't been able to record like share and subscribe uh, stay tuned um might be doing a raffle on something give us some ideas what do you guys want to see us raffle hats uh, we haven't made we have not made shirts yet um i don't know i mean fast and the furious hot wheels so I, Dad, I, I don't know what's your goal um subscribers so my goal like my daughter said so my goal is to to get to a thousand subscribers and if you guys could help out, that'd be great. It's not about the likes or the followers, but
but it's just a personal goal that I it's have. It's about the fun. It's about the fun, and like she said, uh, the memories and everything. That was pretty fun, actually. Anyway, <laughs> keep, you guys fun. have a good night. Thank you guys. Take it easy. Bye. So the average fuel economy, um, getting on it, actually, I, I raced a couple of cars, burning out, doing pulls to get on the highway, uh, letting it idle uh, every day in the morning from the 31st to now, so it's about nine days, a uh, total of 212 miles, 212.6. It averages about 21 miles a gallon, driving it as you wish, as you want.